Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of the Ottoman Empire of Expansion. Where guys, apparently we're getting a cosplay like against these guys because they became communist. And we apparently don't like communism. At least that's what I've heard. He Okay, and yeah, we're about to destroy the Germans. I'm trying my darndest to destroy the Germans. But it is really hard. Like, I didn't expect the Germans to be this hard-headed. In terms of destruction. Like, seriously. They're really hard-headed. And also, I think what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to build quick railroads from here to there. Because I use this a lot. I use this, like, railway a lot. So I'm just going to build, you know, a little bit more railway all around here. To kind of give this... Well, I use a lot of this area, actually, now that I think about it. So we're going to use all this railway... Let's upgrade this. This is what my capitalists are supposed to be doing. What are those capitalist pigs not doing this for? Alright, and then all this upgrading right here. This is all mainland me. Okay, and then also over here. Because this is also where I upgrade. And there we, there we go. Okay, okay, well, let's get back to the war with Germany. That's ending in probably one of the weirdest ways. <sighs> Communism. All right, well, anyways, I'm going to give back control over these guys. Army, I'm going to give back control over you guys. Oh, wait, I don't have control over you guys. Okay, then I'm not going to give back control over you guys. No, I don't have control over you guys. Give back control of the Armenians army. And yeah, communism has now been entered into my world and I don't really like it. Because now I'm going to have to like deal with communist threats all the time. And I really don't like that. I'd rather just deal with my regular threats of Germany and France. Seriously, I don't want to deal with communism. I just lost a major battle against the Germans. I kind of knew that was going to happen though. It wasn't like I didn't know that was going to happen. They had 94k troops all grouped up into one. Don't know how they had that many troops grouped up into one unit. Also, I'm I'm losing people. You guys, stop. Stop moving in. We're killing off more of our people if we keep moving in like this. Okay. We already killed off a lot of them, though. Before I could save them. No. Okay, but that 94k troop is not going to be able to be defeated easily. We're probably going to need to pull off a lot of different, you know, fancy stuff to go defeat them. Uh, but first, I'm going to have to build a new army, so see you guys in a second. Okay guys, I just built a new gigantic troop, and most of them have to travel through this land right here, so I'm going to go destroy all these kind of stupids right there. And regarding this big gigantic army, I, what I believe I'm going to have to do is, I'm just going to have to wait for my vassals to kind of get a bigger army ready. And then I'm going to have to unite all of our army to go defeat them. Uh, because I honestly don't have it right now to uh, go fight against them. Hey, two Sicilies. Oh, yes. But there is somebody I know who could help me out. <laughs> Let's just give it a second. Call them in, maybe. We let 97. Thank you. I was like, we're literally 97. You guys can come in. Okay, they're going to come in. That's going to be nice. With their army, we could possibly have a good gigantic battle, which then could end in me winning, which would be really nice. We end them, we end the war. Because that, oh my goodness, it's now 101. Wow. Yeah. We definitely could not fight that if we just, like, tried. So, let's see. Come on. Hey. Hey. Hey, 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 hey. Uh, to Sicilies, give militaristic access. There we go. Hey, now move through my land. Start conquering. Start conquering. War declared. France attacking Libya. That's fine with me, France. I really don't care what you guys do. But I need to figure out how I'm going to defeat this 100k German death stack. Um, I mean, if worse comes to worse, most likely what we're going to have to do is we're going to have to defeat all this, you know, 100k death stack by ourselves. I guess it wouldn't be bad, but... Hmm. 
This is literally the last army. I know it is. But yet we can't defeat them because they literally have... It's the biggest army they have. <sighs> hmm. I think we're just going to have to wait until I can build a bigger army. Because there's nothing I can do until then. Because they're not going to, they're not going to like, divide up that army. No, no way. They're just going to keep it all grouped up. So, we're just going to have to wait until they do stuff with it. And I can use it. For some reason, you guys are not using it. Which is really angering me. You guys have land access. Why are you guys not using it? Um... Unless by chance do we have any types of armies that could help us. Well, we could have, if I maybe combine all my troops. Uh, let's see, Lombardi's troops could actually be very helpful right about now. If I combined it with that, maybe a halfway built army. Uh, it, it would, I need, I need the two Sicilies army, but they're not going to give it to me. Alright, let's see. I'm going to be keeping... 94k, dang. Such a big army, man. Such a big army. Okay, let's see. Dig in. We got all the troops we can get from there. Alright, let's see. Let's get some administrative... Let's get some, like, more technological stuff from all of our factories, because we're about to have a big boost from factories. Let's see, we're building up our new army. Make sure... I can't really protect that 2k. Uh, yeah. They're slowly starting to move into my land, which isn't good. And for some reason, they're attacking America. Wow, France, you guys are ambitious. If you want to go destroy America, you guys are going to have to try harder than that. Um, I guess what we can do, though, on the side, is that we can go move in and go destroy this army right here. Because, I mean, if we can't destroy the other bigger army, we might as well go see if we can go destroy the uh, smaller army. The smaller dramatic army. Because, I mean, the bigger dramatic army is kind of giving us difficulties. Go destroy the smaller dramatic army. There we go. And just make sure that the Germans don't get any reinforcements. That's the only thing we're doing. Is making sure the Germans don't get any reinforcements. And we're waiting for our own army to be built. We also have those guys crushing all that. And let's see, Lombardi. Now that you guys have finally finished up with all your conquests. Basically conquered all my land back. Thank you very much. Uh... <laughs> That's kind of nice, actually, having those vassals. Uh, but that 77 death stack is still not, still not small enough for me to take on. Ah, okay. Uh, let's see. Dramatic Federation. Sure, we can have the Dramatic Federation like us before they, like, kill us. I mean, they hate us now, but before they really did like us. Now they kind of hate us. Let's see. By the way, if you guys crush through all these guys, you guys kind of need to. I have a lot of soldiers going through over there. Uh, let's see, we also have a couple soldiers going through there, too. Kazan. Let's see, is there any kind of soldiers being made there? Yes, there is. You guys, go crush through this. Let's hope that these guys will be able to do it. Oh, 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 oh. Never mind, never mind. Get out, get out. Retreat, 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 retreat. Retreat, wait. I'm not sure. Should I retreat? Wait, this is like one-on-one, -on -one, 1v1. Oh, no, wait, yay! Oh, so close. Well, they have 0-0. Zero, zero. Okay, go. Literally 0-0. Zero, zero. There we go. Yeah, we won. Okay, we won. Okay, and let's see, 67. That's a lot less than what they used to have. So they're dying at a pretty rapid rate. Um, We have our second army about to be ready again. Hopefully what they could do is that they could attack they could attack Lombardy. I'm actually gonna have my soldiers right here waiting for it. I want them to attack Lombardy. Uh we're actually gonna go engage this army right here to keep them down. As I keep saying, we want to make sure that they just keep on getting down. We don't want them to build any more. But what we're going to do is just keep our army right here. Wait for them to uh move in there's troops to go destroy Lombardy. Hopefully not get another tick, because the ticks are really random when it comes to these armies, okay? Go, 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 go. Yes, okay. They have the advantage, and I think they're on defensive bonus, so this should be really good for us. Supply limit, go right here. Ooh, ooh, ooh. I don't want to pull these guys yet, but they're going to have to be pulled now. Go, 
Go, my men. Be free. Be free. Okay, the Battle of Parma is not going exactly well. But then again, I don't really care about Parma. Okay. Oh, my goodness. This is being a close battle. Oh, my goodness. Send up men. Send up men. Well, either way, these guys are going to be dead because they won't be able to fight anymore. So, I guess we will win this eventually. But I'm sending in my men quickly to go try to go deal with this. New Zealand collapse. So now New Zealand again became a good government of ours. And I believe we won. Ah. Oh, the last little bit of of soldiers. Okay, you guys go back to the capital. Go get the rest of your men. Uh Yeah, I'm pretty sure actually what we could do is um go have half of these guys go uh, now nah, we I don't know how to divide this unit up really effectively so you guys go down here go siege up half the unit you guys not dealing with anything too important France is also moving through my territory and conquering back my land thank you France okay but ah uh, we did it we destroyed the last little bits of the German Empire oh my goodness that was hard really really hard uh, let's see, let's just, let's just cut right through their entire empire, get right into my land, and, oh my goodness, they're gonna be trying to build up, I can already see their little, like, armies building and making stuff to try to counteract me, hey, you guys, also get up here, but it's over, I've officially won the battle, it was a really hard fought battle too, okay, all you guys group up, Disband. Okay, half of you guys go over here. The other half go over there. Okay, and there we go, people. That is how we beat the Germanic Empire. It's through much, much, much tangling. I mean, oh my goodness. This was a hard fought battle. Hard, hard fought battle. It's about over with. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. That was. Whew, that was intense. Okay, let's go right here. Let's go right there. Let's go right there. You guys go right there to arch back to make sure they don't make a new troop. Yes. Okay. You guys go to Khalees just to make sure we start conquering all this back. Uh, Ottoman Red Guards. Yeah, they're not going to succeed. I have a high feeling they won't succeed. Alright. Is that the meeting place? I do believe it is or isn't hmm yes it is so keep these guys right there they're still going to be building up an army let's see do you have any germans over here nope and let's see we're now going to conquer the rest of their land oh man okay we're moving in quite rapidly over there boom 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 okay let's see we got that cut in half we got the land cut in half we got themselves defeated beyond defeated actually we've basically crushed through everything that they hold dear and love uh we did it all through lots and lots of hard work we're about to resiege all back our lands hooray secret police excelente okay police <gasps> yes oh yes Yes, 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 and create a province out of that, and create a province out of that. Oh, and let's look at our new economy. Oh, whoops. Let's get all of our factories we made, the gigantic amount of factories that we now have in our borders. Oh, my goodness. The new people we have to now enslave. Oh, man. We do have kind of a bad economy right now just because of stupidity reasons but yes oh my goodness it just how much would it take to like get out of this uh 10% tariffs uh education let's go to 68 66 65 there we go guys we now have <laughs> we now conquered the dramatic federation that means there was absolutely no, and we already took down the, uh, 
uh, our other good friends, the uh, Bavarians, earlier. So there's basically no Germany to fight against us, which is awesome. Which means we are officially a really powerful nation. Uh, Japanese can even war. I think this has been going on for like a couple years now, and I still haven't finished it. But oh my goodness, that was amazing. We finished up with that war. We're now done. <laughs> oh my goodness, we're now done. Okay, so what I believe I'm going to do now is is I believe I'm going to fight a war against China. Why China? Because I believe I'm probably going to have to conquer China before he becomes a Western power. And I need to make sure we did it when I was still very advanced. So, yeah, this is about a good time to go attack China. Wait, can I form an alliance with China? Just on a side note. Yes, I could. Huh. You know, having a massive Chinese horde would not be bad to, like, use at some point. Hmm. You know what? Before we were to, before we were to uh, fight China... You know what we could do, guys? Is we could use them to uh, destroy the UK. And then after that, we could use them to destroy China. Because with the, uh, let's see, if we get the French on our side, we get the, get the French, we get the Chinese. I believe we're going to easily be able to destroy all of British India and then go destroy, and de destroy mainland France. So, yeah. I'm pretty sure the French are going to be able to defeat these guys, so, yes, let's see if we can get a good alliance with the Chinese. Yes, let's hope they don't just start backing off as soon as we start asking for them to be our friends, and, oh, we just got the Germans, guys. We got the Germans. Oh, my goodness, that is so cool. Cost the th throw output, I mean, we literally have the most factories in the entire game due to that one conquest. Let's see. You guys form an alliance yet? Let's see. If I was to go 12 more. Let's see. Oh my goodness. And if we do this, we could end it. And let's see. The French could attack the uh, British over here. Because they probably have troops somewhere down here. Uh, I have actually troops over here. Wow. Hmm. I did not know that. Well, we have mommies that we could use down here. Denmark is also finishing off this place right over here. Uh, they're also having a fight over there. So if we use that, we could destroy that. We could destroy this part over here. And then that's still sieged up over there. The only part of it would probably be the actual continent itself that we'd have problems with. But that's almost every game. But if we could just land troops on the continent. If France could just land troops on the continent, we could easily destroy all of them. Hmm. They'd probably actually break up a lot of the UK, but I would not mind that. Just breaking up the UK and having them out of the game would definitely be a plus. Okay, well, I think I got my war strategy. So let's go get some Chinese people on our side. Let's see. Yes. Okay. Yes. Now China is definitely our friends, people. So that means a massive horde army, which I'll basically use to go destroy all of these guys, will now be used. Um, Denmark. Okay, so let's see. What do I want to do? All right, I know what I want to do. We're going to add a conquest cause Bella against Denmark. That way we can easily destroy all of Denmark. By the way, can we make a lot of troops from our recent German lands? Yes. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to uh, put a waypoint right here. Uh, uh, wait, wait, I'll wait until that last little troop right there completes, because I don't want to do it just yet, because I need to make sure that we start dividing our men a little bit better, and I'll have three zones now, three zones, I'll have the Germanic zone, the Ottoman Empire zone, and the Russian Empire zone, all making me a lot of men each turn, and me just, like, turning out a profit. By the way, how many men do I have, comparatively to the rest of the world? How many men do I have? France is at the all-time... What the heck? 491 brigades. Huh. They have more than the Chinese Empire does. You know, that's kind of scary right there. That's really kind of scary. I only have 74 brigades. Comparatively, France has 490. 
And I want to thank you guys for watching. See you guys next time on the episodes of the Ottoman Empire, where we are conquering a lot.